In a lush green meadow, where wildflowers danced in the gentle breeze, there lived a curious little bunny named Snowdrop. Snowdrop's fur was as white as freshly fallen snow, and his big sparkly eyes held a hint of mischief. One sunny Easter morning, as Snowdrop skipped through the meadow, he spotted something unusual. Nestled among the wildflowers was a gigantic Easter egg, bigger than any he had ever seen. The egg was painted in vibrant colors, with swirls of pink, blue, and yellow. Wow! exclaimed Snowdrop. What a beautiful egg, I wonder what's inside. He couldn't resist taking a peek. With trembling paws, he gently lifted the lid of the egg. But to his surprise, instead of the usual chocolates and treats, he found nothing. The egg was completely empty. Oh no, cried Snowdrop. The Easter treasure is gone. He hopped around in panic, calling out to all the other animals in the meadow. Help, he shouted. The Easter egg treasure has been stolen. The animals, startled by Snowdrop's cries, rushed to his side. There was Oliver the wise old owl, Harriet the playful hedgehog, and Chester the chattering squirrel. Don't worry, Snowdrop, said Oliver. We'll help you find the treasure. And so, the animals embarked on a grand adventure together. They searched high and low through the meadow, the forest, and even the nearby stream. They asked the other bunnies, the birds, and even the sneaky fox, but no one had seen the missing treasure. As the sun began to set, the animals' hope began to dwindle. But just when they were about to give up, they noticed something peculiar. Near the edge of the meadow, they saw a strange footprint. It was large, with sharp claws, and it didn't belong to any animal they knew. Look, shouted Harriet, that must be the footprint of the thief. The animals followed the footprint, which led them to a dark cave hidden behind a pile of rocks. They peered inside cautiously, and there, in the dim light, they saw the stolen Easter treasure. It was being guarded by a grumpy old badger named Barnaby. Barnaby had a long, bushy tail and a mean look in his eyes. Well, 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 growled Barnaby. Look who's here. The animals who came to steal my treasure. But it's not your treasure, protested Snowdrop. It's the Easter treasure that was meant for all the animals in the meadow. I don't care, said Barnaby. I found it first, so it's mine. The animals knew they couldn't fight Barnaby on their own. So, they came up with a clever plan. Chester, with his quick thinking, grabbed a handful of acorns and tossed them towards the entrance of the cave. The acorns distracted Barnaby, who rushed out to collect them. While Barnaby was busy gathering the acorns, the other animals swiftly grabbed the treasure and made their way out of the cave. Thank you, exclaimed Snowdrop. You saved the Easter egg treasure, the animals were overjoyed. They carried the treasure back to the meadow, where they divided it equally among themselves. And so, the lost Easter egg treasure was found, and everyone had a happy Easter celebration, filled with laughter, games, and delicious treats.